Hello, this is Neil, and here's a short video explaining how to use a Solo Contuti plugin to link a workstation on the iPad to Solo Contuti. In this case, I'm going to be showing it working with GarageBand, but it works with any digital workstation or virtual instrument that supports audio unit plugins. So let's have uh, Solo Contuti, and we see we have Solo Contuti is up and running, and we have a connection. Uh, in the current version, it'll only work if you're connected. And the reason for this is Solo Contuti goes to idle if it's in the background uh, when there's no connection. This is for power saving reasons. Uh, but that does mean that once you start GarageBand, Solo Contuti goes into the background and it will only continue working if you have a session started. Small detail. So we have Solo Contuti going, we have a session started. Let's go to GarageBand. So we started up GarageBand and let's create a new song. And for this, I'm going to use a digital piano. Um, so we have our digital piano set up, and that's our digital piano. And what we need to do is go to Settings, and then halfway down the Settings, there's Plugins and Equalizers, so we can pick that up. And then we have the Edit function. The Edit function, now we have the opportunity with these green uh, circles to add an effect, and we're going to do that. And so Contuti is an audio unit extension, so we're going to choose an audio unit extension, and there you see the Solo Contuti plugin. So we're going to add that. Let's click on that to see what the control panel looks like. Oh, sorry, this compressor. Let's see what the control panel looks like. Now it's a very simple uh, control panel. What we're seeing here is just some basic data about how the connection is. And you'll notice now I can't hear the instrument. The reason for this is that Solo Contuti, uh, the plugin, takes the data coming from the synthesizer and passes it directly through to Solo Contuti. Now, this means you won't actually hear it. You can turn the monitor on on Solo Contuti. That's one way of doing it. The other way is to just allow audio pass through, which will then allow you to hear the instrument. Now, I'm uh, going to turn this off so I can show you how to monitor it on Solo Contuti. The little green plug at the right hand side tells you that you are now connected with the Solo Contuti app. If there's not a connection, then you'll see that uh, that plug is an orange color to indicate there's a problem. Now let's go back to Solo Contuti. We will go back there. And you see now we have at the top right in your own uh, column the little plug uh, icon. So what's happening is that your input, which at this point is coming from the microphone, is now being mixed in with the input from the synthesizer. Uh, one little small point, um, if you actually don't want the input from the microphone, then you just set this to zero, uh, because the volume control doesn't uh, control the volume of the input from the synthesizer, only the volume of the microphone. Uh, the volume from the synthesizer you need, of course, to control from the synthesizer. Now, if we set monitoring on and we go back to uh, GarageBand. Okay, uh, that's about it. That's all you need to do. And uh, have fun.